He said, be better today than you were yesterday. That's my mama. I tell y'all that too. Every day, be better than you were the day before. Wake up the next day and go harder. Wake up the next day and go harder than that. Wake up the next day, go harder than that. You gave 100 one day, you gave 110 the next day, 120 the next day. Keep going, keep going, keep going. I'm gonna be better today than I was yesterday. I'm gonna be better today than I was yesterday. You're gonna be better today than you were yesterday. You the best, you the greatest. We got this. It is 6.35 over here. It's 6.35 over here. She fixed it. She fixed it. She fixed it. I don't I only got this. The one oatmeal packet. So what I'm going to end up doing, I'm going to go get my nanas. And, uh, I'm eating my nanas for breakfast. Give me a few of these. And then... Shout out my little glasses. Boy, the peanut butter. I got my little peanut butter. And let me get the bread. That's all I make. Some bread. And I'm going to toast on me some bread. Some peanut butter. Peanut butter banana sandwiches. Peanut butter, peanut, peanut butter banana sandwiches. Peanut yada 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 Toast up my, toast up, toast up my bread. We using this, this honey wheat, honey wheat bread, honey wheat bread. Using the, the gifts, the gifts. And I'ma cut up my, let me put this down. I'm about to cut up, I'm gonna cut up. My banana. One second, y'all boy. Taking two. Hold up. I may get some may get some eggs too. Y'all wanna see something? Y'all wanna see something? Hold up. You would have thought I was Gordon Ramsay in this bitch, nigga. Would have thought I was Gordon Ramsay, nigga. Fuck you mean, bruh. Nigga, would have thought. Ooh. Would have thought I was Gordon Ramsay, nigga. Iron Chef Marcus, nigga. Fuck you mean, bruh. Iron Chef. They get a little hot. I may throw me a little egg on the other side. Yeah, I'm gonna throw me a little, throw me a little egg on the other side. Kids just don't fill me up. Yeah, my thing is, I like to be full. One second, I'm gonna turn this back around. Yeah, I like to be full. Before I go to work, I like to eat some shit. Cause you see, I already, I already got the, uh, uh, I got the lifting in. I right, got the lift in there, so I like to be full. We just buttering that right now. And then, uh, crack my ass. Crack my ass. I need two quick ones like that. Two eggs real quick. You got it. I'm gonna eat this. Hold up. I'm gonna show you how to finish product, bro. Give me one second. Or I can keep going. That shit about clean. I mean, that shit about done. So, what I'm gonna do, what I'm gonna do now, 
take my take my knife. It's a knife. It's a knife. Do this. Like that. Like that. I should get a spoon, but I already, I already started with this knife. It spread better with the spoon. Like that. Take my bananas. The bananas on the top. The bananas on the top. The bananas on the top. Oh. Oh. Get a little. I'm putting a little bit on the other side. On both. Both of the other side. Not too too much though. So just a little bit on the other side. Like that. And then put the rest of it on top. Oh. And then that's what we looking like. Okay, so take some nanas and each of them. Throw them over. Then we got some peanut butter. We got some peanut butter. Peanut butter and banana sandwiches. And we got some eggs right here. Let me get a spatula right quick so I can flip my egg. It's 43. I got a, I got a few minutes to eat this. So I gotta hop in the shower. And I'll flip our eggs right quick. And then I'm gonna. Uh, Put my sandwiches together. Sandwiches together like so. Oh, you got, got bread. Chris Golden Brown. Golden Brown about the crub. About the crub. You see I know what we looking like. What we looking like about the grub right quick. Y'all boys, I'll be right back. Always running. Always running. Always going. It was 7.04. We got a couple minutes to get there before the bus leave. But I can do it. I got it. I don't get tired. It's cold as fuck, bro. In Florida. Uh, cold. Freezing. It's brick out here. I couldn't imagine being nowhere else and it'd be like cold as hell, like snowing. Like, Cause I hate the cold a lot. Don't fuck with it at all. Since I lived in South Florida my whole life, I like the heat. The cold be fucking me up. But, but you see, I can still keep going in the cold. I can keep going in the rain. Any weather, I can weather any storm. So I'm the man. I made it. I made it. I see the bus, but I made it. I made it. Whoa. Whoa. Sunny South Florida. I made it. I'm unstoppable. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, oh. I'm gonna have a car by the end of this year. I made it. Y'all see that, bro? The fucking, oh my god, that shit was sexy. The little sunrise with the little clouds. Oh my god, it looks like a portal is opening into heaven. So beautiful, so beautiful. The world is a beautiful place, bro. Enjoy your time, enjoy your days, man. Sun is shining too now. See that, bro? With the, with the school bus going by, it's a vibe, bro. A morning vibe. I love it so much. I love it, I love it. It's gonna be a great day. It's here.
me simply just being able to record here. Y'all remember like when I first started, I didn't want to record. I'm too shy to record here. But me simply just doing it and being able to do it shows growth. Now what I gotta do is be able to talk to y'all and speak throughout my whole time here. Because realistically, no one's looking at you. No one really cares what you're doing. Everybody's up trying to get to work, doing their own thing. So you should be doing your own thing too. And trying to progress in any way possible. Everything is a learning process, everything is a learning curve, but I'm heating up. So it feels good. So it feels good. I'm about done though. I'm about to get to work. Y'all see where we at, y'all see what we doing. About to clock in. About to clock in, that mean. I'm about to be in here slaving. Be in here slaving. I still do miss when I, I mean, when I sat up, when I sat the camera up like this, I was doing my little motivational thing, motivation. I be missing that. I be missing that. Because that's when, like I said before, like last video, the one that's uploading right now, I was talking about, I wanted to get out more, more content. I wanted to do more. And me getting up and me talking like, me doing the motivational videos was another form of me hustling, trying to get out more content, hustling the content, getting better. So like, I'm proud of myself for doing that. I gotta make a little compil compilation video of all the shits that I did. Because like I said before, now that I'm vlogging, now that I'm vlogging, I give a lot of the motivation in the vlog. You know, the, the shorts is a quick way to digest shit, but there's no quick way to do shit in the world. No quick way to do nothing. You gotta take the long route, the long road. So with the vlogs, I can come to talk to y'all, chop it up with y'all, give y'all motivation. And like, I got my core right now, my little core fan base, and then I'm building it up and up and up through hard work and dedication. like. I know where I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be great. I'm gonna be the greatest alive. I know it, and that's why I say it. That's why I speak it into existence. This right here, it's a little stepping stone that I'm at. It is, let me see if I can show y'all time. It's eight, 808, 808's and heartbreaks. I'm here from eight, eight to 4.30, slaving. But you know what I did do? I did get up and I did make some content. I did. Get, I am about to go make some content later. I am going to edit and upload some more content. I am about to do what I want. I just got to get this done right now. Sometimes I feel like I'm confined to here. But then you got, I got to realize I'm not confined here. And this is not going to be my life forever. It's a stepping stone. It's a stepping stone. So what forever, for whatever you doing in your life, just know you're not gonna be there forever. That's not gonna be your situation forever. Don't be sad. Don't be sad, keep going. Don't be sad, because you don't wanna be sad on your journey. You gotta get up, keep going, and make it the best, the best possible journey that it can be, because if you able to be the happiest you can be and be like the most productive you can be on your journey, that's when you know something gonna come out of it. That's when you know you're gonna make it. That's when you know you're getting better and better because you're being productive. One second. I usually put my bag up here in the morning. My bag up there. You being the best you that you can be. But I'ma get up, I'ma I'm get to work. I'ma enjoy my little time here before everybody come. I like to chill. I like to like to be by myself a little bit before everybody come. I, that's why I liked it before in the past when I was here for like an hour, hour by myself, just chilling, listening to music, vibing, getting ready for everybody just to come in. 
but now people come in around the same time as me. But you see, I'm here early. When I was recording the motivational videos, I would make sure to get here early. Even time is, time is valuable. Within them five minutes, I was able to get here early and record a short, record a short video. You gotta use your time wisely. If you're not using your time wisely, you're not hustling wisely. You're hustling backwards. It's all about hustling, hustling, getting better, getting to the bag, being the best you can be. Let me get to work. Let me get to work. I'm gonna come back at y'all and we gonna get a workout in. I gotta figure out what kind of routine I wanna do. We gonna get a workout in. And then after that, I'm gonna go record some more in my house and I'm gonna uh, edit, upload, get more, more and more content out. Because like the, what I uploaded on Tuesday, all four of them videos, I'm trying to keep up that pace. Keep it up, keep it up, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep getting better and better. Keep elevating the content making everything better and better and better so like that's the mindset i'm on i'm on growth my mindset on growth what's your mindset on i see how the sky looking it's nighttime it's about to get that night work in plane flying by sky look nice car driving by everybody moving everybody working everybody shaking what are you doing? Gonna get the night work in. That's where we at, we at the pull-up bar. Gonna get some night work in. Always working. Always working. I can feel them, feel them pull-ups. When I come out here and record, sometimes I don't know the workout I'ma do until I get out and do it. I'ma do really like muscle-ups and dips, muscle-ups and dips. Let me see. With my right foot, I don't know what's wrong with it. But when I be stepping, sometimes like a little palm or like the ball of the foot, that shit be fucking aggravating me hella bad. Aggravating like, I feel it right now. I be fighting through it, fighting through that pain, but that shit be aggravating as fuck. Let me get some dips in. Take my shoe off. We gonna get down here, get our push-ups in. Do push-ups every single day. Cause you be getting up in the morning, get at least a hundred push-ups in. I don't even be counting, I be doing. Let me get some pull ups in.
trying to be counting. I just be doing, just be going. I'm going to give it a second, and I'm going to get some dips in. See, I was tired. Working long days, like, I still work my little 40 hours a week. And I still, like, still make my videos. I still do a lot of things, and I be tired. I want to come out here and do this. I was like, sometimes your brain be like, just do upload what you got, upload the footage you got, do it tomorrow, things of the sort. In my mind, I don't even got no real workout plan because my brain don't want me to do it so bad. But I just say, fuck that, and I get up, and I go anyway because I do what I have to do. This is what I want to do, so I'm going to get up and go. Because sometimes your mind don't want you to go. Sometimes your mind wants you to rest. But you got to go that extra mile. You got to take them extra steps. Like, you know, don't waste your time at all. We're going to get these dips in right quick. Let's go. Sometimes your mind can feel drained. Like right now, my mind feels very drained. I don't like the fact that sometimes I don't be thinking about anything. I just be working. I just be doing. I just keep my eye on the prize. But sometimes I don't really like it that way. Sometimes I do like to think about things, but you don't know what to think about because my mind is just set on this one thing this one goal that I got like tunnel vision in a way which is great that which is great that my mind has developed tunnel vision for what I want to do like I, it's a blessing I can't even knock it can't even knock it but it's all up to me to go figure out other ways and other avenues and other ways to hustle. Because this is my long term, this is my long term investment. I'm grateful for this because I'm gonna be able to do this forever. But I wanna think of different avenues and different things I can go, different things I can invest in. I wanna be a business, a businessman, an entrepreneur, like my my mom always said I was gonna be. She was telling me it was always something in me from a child. I always had something in me. And I really want to make her proud because I feel it. And y'all feel it in these videos too. Someone told me, someone that I met at the skate park the other day, DM me, told me my videos were very dope. He really liked it and I deserve more recognition. And I really appreciate him saying that. Saying that I appreciate that I deserve more recognition. But I also got to grind. I also still got to grind. Meek said he was grinding for 10 years. He said he was grinding for 10 years. He said, why can't you grind for seven if I grind it for 10? So I got to grind. I got to grind. I got to put years and years and years in this shit. You can even see, like, your favorite artists look back into their catalogs. They probably got music posted from five years ago. 
10 years ago, long times ago, and they kept grinding, they kept at it, they kept striving because they knew no one else knows what they knew. Let me tell y'all another thing. Your dream is your dream. Your goal is your goal. What you want to be, that's what you have to do. Don't be mad that someone don't support your dream, don't really think you think that you're going to make it, think that you're going to do it. But it's your dream, your goal, something that you're trying to get to, something that you're trying to accomplish. Whoever, whoever is doubting you isn't trying to accomplish your goal or your dream or whatever you're trying to do. You're trying to do that. So don't be sad or don't be discouraged when the person, when the person that you really want to believe in you don't believe in you or they think or you think they don't believe in you or they tell you when you're going to get a real job, something that may make you feel discouraged. Don't feel discouraged. Keep doing what you're doing. Keep striving because you know that it's going to work out. What you're going to do is going to work out. You have it in your mind that it's going to work out. So keep going and keep doing it. It don't matter what no one. They're not doing it for you. They're not going to put in the work for you. They're not going to put in the effort for you. They're just going to be there when you're successful, when you make it. They're going to give you the congratulations. So you got to work for that congratulations. Because that, that, them, them congratulations going to feel good. But they're not going to feel as good as you putting in the work, putting in the effort every single day. You getting tired and you getting up, doing it again. What did I say in the beginning of this video? You're going to get up, do it again. Get up, do it again. Get up, doing it again. Get up, doing it again. Someone said you was given 100 one day, give 120 the next day, give 140 the next day, 150. Keep going up, up, and up. Keep getting better. It's going full circle again. Going full circle. The vlog going full circle. Like, I didn't want to do this, but I did it yesterday. And if I didn't do this today, I would have given 90. I ain't trying to regress. I ain't trying to go back. I'm not trying to give 90. I'm trying to give 120. I'm trying to give 140 tomorrow. 150 the next day. Keep going, keep going, keep better, keep getting better, keep striving for better. Keep being the best you that you can be. We gonna get our dips in. This was pull ups and dips. But I was trying to come out here pull ups and dips, pull ups and dips, and talk to y'all. Pull ups and dips. We gonna get our dips in. Those dips made me, those dips made me feel strong. The tricep is really the hardest muscle to work. In my, in my opinion, getting your tricep to pop is very, very difficult. So I always, I, I do a lot of tricep work, tricep exercises. The regular, the regular beginner just dips don't work for me no more because I've been working so much and I'm grateful that it don't work no more because it's always like progression. Keep progressing, keep getting better. I'm getting better like with everything I do. Every aspect of life, I keep getting better. With video making, I keep getting better. Within my relationships, within family life, I keep getting better. So, you gotta keep getting better. I'm really trying to paint y'all a blueprint, 
a blueprint. I'm gonna get my pull-ups in. I'm really trying to show y'all the grind because I'm the test dummy. I'm the guinea pig. When I do it, you gonna know that you can do it too. I love y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all. I love everybody to watch the content. I love that we growing. Love that we getting bigger. I told y'all, I feel it coming. I'm about to heat up. I feel it. It's gonna happen. That's why I keep working, keep filming, keep getting better. Because I, you gotta be prepared for it. You got to stay ready so you don't got to get ready. I'm staying ready. I'm working. I'm striving. So when it come, I don't got to get ready. I don't got to learn how to work. I don't got to learn how to do this, do that, do that, do that, do that. Because I got it. I'm ready. I'm ready to go. War ready. Battle tested. And I came out. If a nigga knock you down, don't stay down. Don't stay down. Get up. The ref gonna count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You get up at eight. You get up at eight, show them your gloves. Walk forward, show them your gloves, and keep going. Keep fighting. Don't let nobody count you out. Don't let nobody count you out. That's why I tell people, don't ever count me out. And don't ever say I'm not going to do something because I stay winning. I keep winning. I'll never stop winning. I'm the best. I'm the greatest. I'm a living legend. I'm going to be the biggest Marcus to ever live. Big mansion. Big everything that I ever wanted. Because I'm the greatest. Big fan base. Everything everything because I'm the greatest let me get my push-ups in scary hours right now work hours hard work hours you see anybody around me no because you gotta put in the work I gotta put in the work ain't nobody gonna do this for me ain't nobody gonna get on the ground and do these push-ups for me. I gotta do them. <clears throat> Don't nobody wanna see you shine. Don't nobody wanna see you win. You gotta shine. You gotta win for yourself. You know in your heart you a winner. You know you in, in your heart you're a winner. You may not know how to start, but you gotta get up and try. You gotta get up and figure it out. And soon, through figuring it out, you'll find a way. You'll find a way. Just ask for forgiveness for being lost, but you're gonna find your way. You gotta keep going, keep striving, keep being the best you. You see me, I'm a testament to that. I was smoking and I was drinking in my backyard every single day. I would get up, go to work, get off, buy a six pack, go sit in the backyard and just listen to music, smoke and drink. Then go to sleep in my work uniform, get up and do it all again. And then one day I decided no more. One day I decided I was going to change my life for the better. And I started posting more on YouTube. Didn't know what I was gonna post. Didn't know what I was gonna do. 
but you see me finding my way. Posted a tattoo tour. I didn't know I was gonna do a tattoo tour. Posting mukbangs, like vlogs, daily vlogs. I didn't workout videos, didn't know, music videos. Didn't know I was gonna do any of that. And the list go on and on and on. Didn't know I, YouTube shorts, bring out the shorts game. Didn't know I was gonna do that. Fucking more dreadlock content. I did not like dreadlock content when I started. I'm getting better and better and better. Reviewing all these food reviews, reviewing, reviewing so, so much content on the channel. I'm getting better and better and better. And that didn't happen until I started. Until I wanted to do something. I had a vision. I wrote it down. And I made my imagination come to life. And that's what you got to do. You got to make your imagination come to life. Any vision that, that you got in your mind, anything that you got in your mind, you can do it. You can accomplish it because it all starts with you. Y'all keep living good. I love y'all.